In other news, parents of students in Harrison County are concerned after two reported threats against the high school. Cynthiana police say two juveniles have been taken into custody. Catherine Gardner joins us now live from Harrison County with this story. Well, Dia, several parents of Harrison County High School students tell me they're angry and frustrated to know that school was in session today after hearing about a threat that was reported last night and a separate threat that was reported this morning. Cynthiana police say they received the first report of a possible threat around 10 last night, saying violence will happen during school hours today at the high school. Harrison County Schools posted on Facebook a couple hours ago, saying, quote, this morning, while our buses were en route to school, the Cynthiana Police Department, after further investigation, informed the Harrison County School District that the threat toward Harrison County High School has now been confirmed and the suspect is in custody, end quote. Shortly after, Harrison County Schools added another post Post, saying at approximately 845, the sheriff's department was made aware of a separate incident involving a threat from one high school student to another high school student. The high school was put on lockdown and remained on lockdown until it was determined that neither student was in school and the student making threats was in police custody, end quote. One woman shared with me she received the first text around 6 this morning, saying there will be extra security at the school due to a threat and police will be on site. Although she's grateful, officials took action quickly. She says you can never be too careful, especially after the fatal school shooting in Marshall County. They were at school already. She had messaged me, said they were on lockdown. They had a student in a classroom, I guess, and that was it. How it's scary. Feel? I don't, I homeschool her, but you know, this is her senior year. She's about done and this is the fun year. I mean, I hate to take her out on the best year she's going to have. Now, the names of those involved have not been released due to being juveniles, and we know of at least one suspect in custody now. If your student didn't go to Harrison County High School today, their absence will be excused. Covering the news in Harrison County live from the LEX 18 Mobile Newsroom, back to you.